Hey guys, Mr. Evans here. Uh, I'm going to show you how to log into Amplify and uh, give you kind of the step-by-step -step for how to get in there and let's get started. So first step is to make sure that you open up uh, Google Chrome. Uh, you don't want to have uh, the, um, you don't want to have Internet Explorer or Firefox because that is going to cause problems in some of the uh, Sims and stuff like that. So Google Chrome is the best one to use. Uh, when you get into Google Chrome, you're going to find the Seattle Schools website, and then you want to select uh, the student family portals. So you click on that, and then you'll have to scroll down and click on student portal right there. Once you've got student portal, it should take you to the clever page. And if you're using your uh, school laptop, then this should all run pretty smoothly. When you get in here, make sure that you have selected um, Amplify as being one of your favorites. If you haven't done that, you'll have to scroll down and find Amplify. So there it is in math and science. And when you hover over the icon, what you'll see is a little heart. And if that heart looks like this, that means it is not going to appear at the top. So you want to click it so that it's got the red circle. And when it has the red circle, you go up here and sure enough, there it is. So we're going to click on the Amplify icon there. And that's going to take you straight into, ta-da, my internet's working a little slow right now, um, but there we go it'll take you into this page. Now, sometimes it'll take you into a different page. Like if you were, I don't know, maybe you were looking at thermal energy. And so you, you had clicked into that. And by the time you log back in, it actually takes you back to the same place. Now, if you're wondering how to figure out where you are, all you got to do is look up here at the um, Amplify navigation bar. And you can see we're in Amplify Science. This is the thermal energy unit, chapter two, lesson 2.2. And so if that's the wrong place, then how do you get back? Um, all you gotta do is click on Amplify Science that returns you to the main page. On that main page, you should see sixth grade there. Uh, if you don't see sixth grade, that means that uh, there's something, maybe they've, they've uh, gotta make some changes to how you've been sorted out into the classes. Uh, you can select on the down menu and you should still see sixth grade. If you don't see that, definitely send me a message, let me know, and I'll get that fixed. Um, anyway, so we're in here. Um, you, We're gonna be starting on microbiome. So when you get to that main page, you can click on a unit like microbiome, and you'll see up here in the navigation bar, it shows up, there it is, microbiome. Now I'm just on the unit page here, so that's the only thing that shows up in the navigation bar. But if I choose to enter a chapter, and then a lesson, let's do lesson 1.1. Uh, you'll see all of those show up right up here at the top. Now, once I'm inside of a lesson, there are a few different things that can happen. Um, I can go down here and follow along with these lesson activities. So there's seven activities. I have a little bit more than you'll have. I've got the teacher bar, but you scroll across here and it'll show you everything um, that we may do. And we might not do all of the activities in a lesson, but we'll do uh, several of them. So you click on an activity and then it'll give you um, each of the pieces. Um, this one has some slideshows associated with it and some questions and, um, and so it should be pretty cool. Um, the only other menu you need to know is over here, there's the three bar menu. So when you click on the three bar menu, that gives you quick access to things like the library in case there's some readings that you wanna do um, that you wanna access on the computer. And then there's also over here, we have the different SIMs and engineering activities. Um, and so this is just a quick way to get to those, <clears throat> excuse me. And that's pretty much it. Make sure that you use Google Chrome, easier to log on with a school computer probably. And, uh, and then make sure you're using that navigation bar and you should be good. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, you can send me an email on uh, Schoology or you can send me an e just a regular email. Uh, either one is great. All right, you guys. Um, that's it. We'll see you later.